Hello, saviors, and welcome. My name is Savar24. Today, we're not going on some grand adventure or epic quest. Today, we're taking a nice peaceful stroll in Stardew Valley. This is a game where you take the role of a young kid who has inherited a farm and is play and is playing the role of in of getting this farm up to a new era. I've seen a couple of gameplays of the startup of this game, but I really don't know much more other than that. But I figured I'd play it just in case, and I know I'm going to miss out on a bit of the first reaction stuff, but it's still going to be pretty good, and it's going to be a new experience for me as well. So let's get into it, shall we? My name is going to be S-E-A-V-I-R, -E farm name. Saviors... Savior Hill. Favorite thing? Uh, I don't know. That's a good question. What would be? My, I like dogs. Hmm. My favorite thing. Well. Pizza. I like pizza. Pizza is my favorite kind of food. Okay, so let's see. A uh, skin. Wow, they got a nice array of colorful skins. Even green skin. Well, red skin, okay. Uh, that's a little bit... Okay. There we go. That's gonna have to be good for me. Hair. Ah, <laughs> yeah, right. I'll be punking all over the place. Can I? Yeah, the, that's definitely a punk hairdo. Oh man, there's all kinds of stuff here. Uh, da, da, da. Ooh, I get some long sassy hair. That'd be very nice. <laughs> oh gosh, what the? Uh, no. Oh man. Good lord, there's a lot of hair options in this thing. Okay, so let's go back to hair one real quick and see what that looks like. Uh, uh, da -da. My hair's not really that spiky, but I guess I don't have to portray it as myself, really. Oh man, this is, this is pretty good. Okay, I'm not going to go anywhere past that. So let's go with that hairdo. That's, that should be good. Shirt. Up, up, uh. A tux, really? Uh. Orange shirt, so far. That's the best one I've seen. In my opinion. Wow, there's a lot of shirts. Uh, wow, okay. There are a lot of shirts. Okay. <laughs> wow, okay, uh, it's a me, Mario! Well, sort of, the colors are somewhat wrong. Wow, okay, uh, what's that? Nope. Let me guess, there's about a hundred shirts. There's more than a hundred shirts. Okay, that one looks good. I'm not gonna go through all of them, but I may as well have. Uh. What's with these accessories? They're kind of weird. A blue collar? Is that a duck bill? That's a duck bill. What? What is PewDiePie doing in here? I'll just go with a regular face. Okay. Pants color. Eye color. Eye color is going to be blue. There we go. That should be good. Oh, wow. Uh, let's make them a bit... Okay, that's a little too bright. Let's go back down a notch. 
Yeah, there we go. That should be good. Hair color. Hair color's fine. I'm good with the hair color. Pants color. Yeah, I like the pants color. Okay, so there we go. We're good. Into the intro. And that is our grandpa on his uh, sick. And for my very special grandson, possibly his deathbed. I want you to have this sealed envelope. No, I think it was just him being uh, sick, is all. No, no. Don't open it yet. Have patience. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. I can't speed up the dialogue here. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. And now I must go to sleep. Now let Grandpa rest. Close enough. Some years later. Work. Work. Wow. These are like randomly generate. Is that supposed to be Mario? That was Mario. Terminated? Oh. What? Woody, what are you doing? Yeah, I saw Markiplier, so I know he did that exact same thing. And there's me. And he's feeling the crush of modern life. Wow. Security cameras in every booth. That's kind of... And now he grabs the envelope and opens it up. If you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me. Long ago, I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I have enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Savior Hill Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Sure. I can do that. And now we've taken the bus. Ah, look at that beautiful scenery. Look at that beautiful background. That is just gorgeous. Even for a simplistic style. It doesn't have to have a great art style in order for it to be... Well, it doesn't have to have high-end graphics for it to be great art style, is what I meant to say. <laughs> Hello, you must be Savar. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here, if you'll follow me. Yeah, it's a little worn down. This is Savior Hill Farm. Wah! It's got all kinds of weeds and rocks and stuff and all that. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have to clean up and you'll have it cleaned up in no time. And here we are, your new home. Oh, hi! Ah, the new farmer. Hi, Lewis! You're the guy Grandpa told me about. Welcome, I'm Ma I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking you about, about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. It's a bit of a shack, really. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little bit more apt, though. Hey! 
Rude. <laughs> Don't listen to her. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied with that so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Hmm. Oh, he nailed her. <laughs> anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Well, good luck. Well, I have two mouses. Did you... You guys saw that, right? I had two mice. Saving. Your progress has been saved. Okay, so I... Oh, hi. Oh, don't swing at the... Stop swinging. How do I... Oh, okay. New journal entry. Parsnip seeds. 15. Here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Oh, okay. Journal. Getting started. Introductions. Okay, I don't really need to worry about that stuff. So this is all my gear. This is everything I have. Um, The scythe, the hu... The scythe, the pickaxe, and the axe are all used to get rid of stuff that is unwanted. The hoe is to um, rake up ground, and then the watering can is to pl is to water seeds that I've planted. Okay, so I need to find a way. I need to figure out how to move stuff around here. Um, maybe if I go into my inventory. There we go. So if I take my scythe, I'm gonna move stuff around real quick. There we go, that ought to help. Yay, okay, so now I have everything in a nice assorted order. It was kind of jumbled up before. So I'll have my axe for chopping down wood, my pickaxe for getting rid of rocks, and then my scythe for cutting down weeds and grass and stuff like that. My hoe will allow me to, gain, to dig holes, and my water can will allow me to water seeds, and everything else can be used for planting the seeds. So let's go outside right now. Let's start by getting rid of a bunch of these rocks. So, chunk, chunk. <laughs> Chunk. Oh, chunk. I forget that the way you attack is the in, is in the direction of your mouse. That's kind of weird, but at the same time, it's a nice way to make sure you hit your target. So I'm just going to deal with the majority of stuff around the front of my house. Uh, just around the general area of my house first. What's this? I don't know what that is. Okay, let's go to the hoe. Ooh, nice area. Mix seeds. Nice to cut down grass, stuff like that. Grass and weeds. Okay, let's go back to the pickaxe. Get the uh, axe. Chop up some wood. Chop down these rocks. Oh, I missed. Okay, you guys may hear some rumbling sounds. If you do, don't worry. That's just the uh, thunder in the background. It's uh, it's kind of storming around my house at the moment. Okay, so let's go to the axe. Chop up that. Chop up that. Chop. Chop. Kind of wish I had a bug net so I could capture butterflies and stuff like that. What? Yes, you can go now. As soon as you opened up the door, I decided to pause. A little late. <laughs> still, a little late. I'll just have to edit this part out, but still. Telling how much time I've been recording. Now go, go, go. Go! Alright, so here we go. Ah. Let's just get rid of all this unwanted foliage. I was thinking another word. Don't know why. I was thinking. Here we go. And... The scythe really doesn't seem to take out any energy, though. I can use this all day, practically, and still 
not have to worry about running out of energy. Now the pickaxe and the axe are a bit of a different story, however. They seem to take up energy. I don't know about the hoe. Stop attacking the rock! Okay, so let's just get rid of the stone. Get rid of the wood. Your axe isn't strong enough to break the stump. Right, okay then. Break the rock. Oh, wrong button. Or wrong tool, anyways. Okay, so let's go over here. Scythe away. Scythe ho! So I'm just going to be doing a lot of this whole farming, or cleaning up, I guess we could call it. For a little while. I could just go ahead and skip it so that you guys don't have to worry about seeing the boring part. Okay, so I've done enough cleaning up for a little while. Now I guess I may as well just go ahead and plant a few things. So let's go ahead and take out the hoe. Okay, so let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, let's spread out now and... Okay, now six. Okay, so I got three more I can place. Let's go one, two, and then we'll switch over back to my hoe. Dig another spot, and now let's go for five. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I missed. I missed! No! Stop missing! No! Stop missing! Oh, okay. So I got a few points of energy left. I could try and bury these seeds. Do I have enough energy, though? Probably not. Can the seeds give me energy? Okay, I guess not. Uh, okay, so coal, resource. I got a lot of stuff here, so... Um, maybe I could. So let's go ahead and... Let, let's just take the hoe real quick and... If I do have enough energy, it's going to be barely enough energy. Yeah, who knows what's going to grow with these mixed seeds. And I have two points of energy left. Okay, so let's go to the box over here. Um, okay, yeah, there we go. Put the stone, the grass, the other mixed seeds, the wood, and the coal. And okie dokie. Now it's time to go to town and see who we can meet. Yeah! Okay, that's a bus. I don't want to go to the bus. Is it, do, do I have a map? Okay, yeah, I do have a map. Wow, there's a lot of place to explore. What's this? The Wizard's Tower. There's a wizard who lives here? Okay, what else is there? Um, Leah's Cottage. Marnie's Ranch. Savior Hill Farm. Uh, Willow Lane. Willow Lane. Mayor's Manor, Blacksmith, Stardew Valley Museum and Library, Elliot's Cabin, Joja Mart, Unknown, Unknown, Mines, Tent, Carpenter Shop, Community Center. Oh, there's a lot of stuff. I wonder what the bus stop takes me to. Who knows? Let's go try and meet some people. Hi! 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 Harvey! It's a pleasure to meet you! I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Sweet! 
I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's a rewarding work. Or, it's rewarding work. Alright. So, who else is around here? Can I find anybody? Anybody at all? Who is at all? I don't know. I found bread in a trash can. says it gives me cooking. Can I eat it? Eat this bread? Yeah, why not? Yeah, and I got 50 energy, so I could go plant more stuff if I ever had more seeds. Hello! Oh, a stranger. Name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Hi, Vincent. Nice to meet you. And you are? Jody. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Hi, Jody. Okay, so that's a room. I don't think I can... Uh, yeah, I can't go in there. Uh, hello? Oh, what's this? Oh, a report card. Wow, Vincent's actually not doing too bad, although his spelling could use work. But he could... Uh, is a good boy, but he could make do with a little more studying. Okay. Knock, knock. With Sam to enter the... Well, he's right there, so I can't exactly talk to him either. And there goes Vincent into his bedroom. Oh, it's 7 p.m.? Oh, I might have to go to bed soon. It's kind of late. Who else can I talk to? Oh, Hi! Hi, Haley. Oh, you're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Yes, I am. Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. Nice to meet you, Haley. Anything else? Hmm, if I weren't for the... If it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be cute. Thanks. For what? I'm not entirely sure. There was a sewer down there. I saw that much. Um, it's getting late, so maybe I have to... Go to bed soon. Okay, there's a doctor's place there. Is there a place where I can buy stuff? Saloon. Pierre's General Store. Oh, well, actually, that answers my question. Where's the store? Community said. Well, I completely passed it up somehow. It's nighttime. Is this it? Is this the gen? Oh, this is the General Store. What's this? Nothing posted today. Okay. Backpack upgrade, 24... Oh, I don't have that kind of cash. Well, it looks like I missed the general store, so I may as well go out and see what else I can do on my farm. So I'll be back. I'm guessing everybody's asleep, too, so I'll just go ahead and go back to my farm and do some bit, a bit more farming before I turn in for the night. And then I'm going to end the episode there. Okay, so that's it. I am done. Oh, man, I have one additional seed. <laughs> Alright, uh, no, wrong button. There we go. Okay, and that's it. Um, that's all I have. Now it's time to go to bed and see what happens. Sleep for the night? Yes, sir! Farming, foraging, fishing, mining, other... Yeah, I got quite a bit. What's this? Oh, wow, okay, so other is the stuff that is kind of useless, but I can still get a lot of money for it. Good lord, two gold for a piece of stone, two for a piece of wood, one for a piece of fiber, and nothing for mixed seeds? Really? Man. Mining. Two pieces of coal worth 15 gold each. Oh, wow, that's a quite a bit of gold. I got 303 gold from all of that. Sweet! Second day of spring. Year one. Let's get to it. Okay, I'm not sure how to save in this game. I'm not sure what to. I'm not sure what to do at, at all, really. Oh, I got mail. And look, my stuff is growing. Yay! Let's see. Hello, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Signed, Willie. Willie. 
Alright, cool. But it looks like that's going to have to be everything I have. I, I do. I really want to know if there's a way to save. Okay, yeah, so there's no way I can save. Maybe it just happens every day I uh, go to sleep. I don't know. But that's going to have to be it for me. Yeah, this is st and this is Stardew Valley. It's a peaceful little game. It's nice, relaxing, and calming, unlike Blitzbreaker, which I had just beaten. But well, that's going to have to be everything. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. Leave comment in the section below, and I will see you guys in the next video. Take care, everybody!